so today I did a thing. Oh, I'm so excited. So, as most of y'all know, I have Alpha Gal, and if you don't know what Alpha Gal is, then you probably didn't click on this. <laughs> um, Alpha Gal is an allergy set on by a tick bite, and it makes it to where you cannot eat red meat, pork, basically anything that doesn't swim or fly, you can't eat it. No, no deer, no nothing. And it's an awful, awful allergy. So I have been reading quite a bit the past several months, maybe even a year. I'm just kind of a chicken. And I wasn't really sure if it worked anyways, but there is this new treatment out there and it's called SAT treatment, S-A-A-T. And I'll put the technical name for it down below. I can't say it, so I'm not even gonna try. It is a treatment, it's an acupuncture treatment and they put some little pins in your ear and three weeks later, they take them out and supposedly you can eat meat. I was skeptical and I think that's why it's taken me over a year to, to actually get it done. Um, <laughs> but I joined a couple of Facebook groups that talked about it and I was like, you know what, let's do this. So. Here in my area, there isn't anybody really local. I drove almost two hours, um, hour and a half, two hours, somewhere in there, to go have my treatment done in Lynchburg, Virginia. They were so helpful, so helpful. They answered every single question that I ever had and ever could even think of. And they went through what they were gonna be doing and why they were doing it. And it, it was just amazing to me. It was very, uh, very informative. So what you do is you go there, you pay their fee um, to have my levels checked, to have the procedure done and to have my, the levels checked again in three weeks to be able to eat meat again. Y'all, I'd pay this, I'd pay it triple times over, okay? Having an allergy, having a food allergy, any type of food allergy is just ridiculous. It changes your life. <laughs> but anyways, so they asked me if I had any other allergies other than alpha gal and I told them about it. And so they tested me for that as well. And what you do is you lay on a table and they stick a metal probe in one hand. You have to take off all your jewelry. That's why I'm not wearing anything right now. Um, so they put a metal probe in your hand and it's hooked up to a magical machine that I don't know what that's called. And anyways, they put the allergen into said magical machine and they try to use pressure to put your hand down. If you can withstand the pressure that they put on your hand, then you are not allergic to it. If you cannot keep your hand up, they are allowed to push your arm down or hand down then you are allergic to it. It seems so stupid simple and it seems kind of like a joke. My husband was sitting there watching me do it and as I told him, it feels like that little bitty woman was 300 pounds. I could not keep my arms up. I mean, it, every single thing that she tested me for dealing with alpha gal, I mean, it was just, it was ridiculous. It felt like I was arm wrestling, you know, and I was like a three-year-old trying to arm wrestle an adult. Like, <laughs> it was insane. So I tested positive for beef, pork, <coughs> excuse me, very high for venison, which around here is, it's like the way of life around here. And also I have an allergy to dairy. And I personally had an allergy to walnuts and it's very odd that I have an allergy to only one tree nut, but turns out they could test for it. So they did and I was allergic to all of those. And so 
she stuck this little other magical machine into my ear and it sounded like I asked Justin later what it looked like and he said that it looked like a really big thermometer but to me in my ear not being able to see what she was using it sounded like um I don't know what they're called but like they look like little pins and you stick them in like light sockets to see if the electricity is live because it sounded like that like it was just beeping like all over the place in my ear and so once that was done she just put little dots and she put a practice pin in there to make sure that she had the exact spot and she did the testing again and I was actually able to keep my hand up so she knew that she had the right spot so after that she took the practice pins out and she stuck the actual needle in there that I will wear for three weeks put a little bit of skin glue on there a patch voila here I am And so the number one question is, does it hurt? Um, the practice pen, it, it felt like a little needle. I mean, it was just like a little bitty prick on there. Wasn't anything, wasn't anything serious. I didn't even grab the table flinch or anything. Like you could just feel it. Um, then when it was time for the actual pen, the only way that I didn't describe it, because it's such a little needle, uh, is, do you remember when you were younger and you would get like super bored and there was like a safety pin or something around and you kind of stick it between the layers of your fingers and be like, oh, look, mom, I impaled myself. Um, so that's what it felt like. Like you can tell that it's there. It doesn't hurt. It's just, it's just there. Um, the only thing is you can't get it wet. So they gave me a little ear cap for me to wear in the shower so that I don't get it wet. And I go back in the middle of July to get them out. And if it doesn't take the first time, they will um, do it again for free a second time. And there's that. Um, they did say that if I were to go back to my regular allergenist and have my blood drawn again, that my levels will still be high. It's not changing my blood at all. All that it's doing is changing the way that my body reacts and sends out antihistamines. So I don't know how it works. I just know that it's a miracle acupuncture treatment for alpha-gal called SAT and I am so super excited to be able to try this and experiment with it and eat meat again. You guys, I want a steak and some bacon so bad. I can't even tell you. I'm just so excited, you guys. This is, I say it a lot, but this is going to be a game changer. And I cannot wait to share my results with you guys and see, see if it works. I'm so excited. So I will keep you posted on that and all the other things that are going on. I'll see y'all in the next one. Bye.